San Diego has launched a new website, though, full of resources and information uh, in order to help its breweries. Casey McKinnon is live at Carl Strauss Brewery in downtown with more on this. Good morning, Casey. Hey, Casey. Hi, good morning. Yeah, well, that website was launched by the city of San Diego, and it's called Business is Brewing, and they put that out as a way to help 144 breweries here in San Diego, and it's a map that shows you where they are and what times they're open. So you can go and support those local businesses because after your shutdowns, they're still trying to stay open. So I have Chad Heath with us from Carl Strauss Brewing in downtown San Diego. Good morning. Good morning. What are your thoughts on this new website that the city of San Diego is trying to do to help you guys stay in business? Hey, look, we'll take all the help we can get. It's been a year I can't wait to forget. So uh, we'll take any publicity, anything to help drive traffic into our brew pubs and into our breweries. So we like it. I think it would have been a little bit of a better use to work with the San Diego Brewers Guild on that. They have a similar map like that. They've been doing a lot to try and promote tourism into our brewery community here in San Diego. And look, this is a tourism city and the breweries are a major reason why people come to San Diego is to visit the 144 breweries that you mentioned. So they've been promoting it for a long time. Just felt a little disjointed that they weren't part of this program. Yeah. And you said that you didn't even know about it before we came out and told you that, hey, you're on this map that the city put out. So what are your thoughts? Do you think people are going to be going to the city of San Diego's website? and finding breweries such as Carl Strauss and coming down to support them? Yeah, sure. I mean, I think that, again, people are going to go look to try and find out what's going on in San Diego, and that might be one of the many places that they're going to go try and see what's going on down here in our city. Um, but again, it probably isn't the first place some people are going to go look. The Brewers Guild site gets a lot of traffic, and that would have maybe been a better place for it. But again, we'll take all the help we can get. We're allowed to have this beautiful patio out here. We want to keep that going, and hopefully that goes for a long time, because this has really helped our breweries and our brew pubs stay in business and keep people People interested in coming back to our facilities. Yeah, well, let's talk about this outside patio because with the restrictions, you're allowed to have this. So if the tier system goes away, what happens then? It's a really good question. We are hopeful that we are allowed to keep these in place. But as the as it sits today, once the restrictions are lifted, we're technically not able to have these in place. So hopefully we can work with the city. They'll allow us to keep these in place. It's San Diego. People pay weather tax to live here. Alfresco Dining should be here to stay. Yeah, and you said that more people that do come to Carl Strauss want to sit here outside. They do, right? So there are people that maybe are more comfortable sitting outside or they just want to experience the beautiful weather and enjoy a great beer and some food outside with their friends and family. So, yeah, keep them in place. It's a good thing. Yeah, and you did say that also you're trying to get over this past year of shutdowns and trying to stay in business because business has been brewing for quite some time now. So you guys are still holding on and fighting the good fight. Yeah, we've been in business now for 32 years. We've weathered a lot of storms. This one has definitely hit us pretty hard. Um, but yes, we are optimistic that the worst is behind us. It's interesting getting staff is still a little tough because of the unemployment benefits that are out there. But we're fighting the good fight. Our staff is stoked to be uh, back open again, more people enjoying the inside of it. So yeah, we're just thankful to be here today talking to you. Yeah, and what's great about Carl Strauss is that you guys also have some delicious food. I know the Brussels sprouts are out here but those are probably my favorite yeah we get a lot of compliments on our brussels sprouts so thank you we've got our salmon caesar salad our beautiful pretzels and our grass-fed burger out here uh, we're launching a new beer today beachwood it's a collaboration with beachwood brewing company out of um, long beach so it launches today go to your local brew pub and come on down and get you one well chad thank you so much for having us out here this morning at carl strauss in downtown san diego really do appreciate it paul and lauren will go ahead and send things back over to you all right. Thanks, Casey. Have they, uh, I bet they've noticed a, a bit of an uptick. Oh, I bet.